Hello there, this is Dennis Jers and my son Peter, and Peter has expressed some interest in doing another interactive fiction screencast. Mm -hmm. And perfectly selfishly, I asked him to play a game that was written by somebody that he knows well. Who wrote this game, Peter? You. Yeah. So, um, okay, before we play it, what do you know about this game? That it involves a character you invented named Troy Sterling. Okay, what do you know about Troy Sterling? That he has a race car, that he's self-centered, and that he likes going on adventures. If I can, if I pick that up from your slideshow, right? Okay. Oh, you're thinking of the um, <laughs> active versus passive verb slideshow. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, okay. Well, what else do you know about this game? It's a text adventure game, so it will have no graphics. When did you finish it? I, you've been working on it for a while, haven't you? I haven't been working on it for a while, but I finished it, I think it was 2001. Oh. Then, why do you, why did you keep saying that you were working on your interactive fiction? Oh, because I'm working on another one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe in ten years I'll let you play that one, too. Okay, so, you ready to get started? Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. What else would we, well, what else would we be here for? Life of an Aerodouble Adventure. Oh wait, it, it doesn't need a scroller yet because it hasn't reached the bottom of the screen. Uh, an automated romance. Chapter 1, The Call of the Open Road. I think I better hit H. Mm, I better do help commands. What are you doing? I'm looking at your Legos. Go ahead, keep playing. Our Legos, just the family Legos, shall we say. Do they have any kind of text adventure strategy games? I mean, using the sprite programming from there, could you make, I don't know, tanks roll around or something? Or would it just be too complicated without graphics to, um, to explain? Yeah, you, you actually get so much information from looking at a screen of graphics for a text game to convey that much information, you know, where the tank is, where its turret is pointing, what the landscape is between you and the gun, would take a lot of words. So text adventure games tend to focus on locations and stories and objects and conversation and things like that, it's rather than sort of a god game level strategy. Because sometimes I've imagined, what if, what if a game like, like today, like, I don't know, Half-Life 2, was was a text adventure game? Could they still t tell it, like, around the corner there is a turret floor, or turret ground, your ant lines charge toward it? Could you make a... oh well. I, well, you certainly could. Okay, I, I remember some of this from Colossal Cave. Um... Ha 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 ha. like the Shakespeare oh. references. <laughs> That's my favorite story. My sh my favorite Shakespearean story, Macbeth. You don't actually get to meet him, do you? Macbeth? No, not in this game, <laughs> no. I'm not familiar with Ophelia. Is she. Hamlet. Oh. And would that be Plump Jack from Henry V? Falstaff, give the wine to me. Yes, in fact. Henry V actually mentions Falstaff, but he doesn't actually appear in Henry V. He's in Henry IV, Part One and Part Two. Oh, so those were flashbacks in the film version. That's right. That's right. Yes. When thou art king, who will not banish a thief? But he did die in Henry V, didn't he? 
Yes. Yes. Off, off stage. And, yeah, and they just it. have the, yeah. the mm-hmm. page boy come down. False stuff is death yes. to you. Better use that one often. Which one? Save. Okay. Aloysius? Aloysius. Oh. Aloysius Brain. I don't know. I I like it when it doesn't recognize the verbs. It's just like start. Oh, you like it? Oh, that that <laughs> explains why you like interactive fiction then. Didn't think of that. Such a rookie. Sorry, I'm, I, I'm... That's okay. Uh, really, if the program were better, it probably should have let that mistake happen. I think I put in some misspellings of Aloysius' name, but I didn't put in the misspelling of break. Yes, I can't see it. I know it's really picky. Just doing what it's programmed to do. It's the when I receive programming. He's making a reference to uh, a block, a little logic construction block in the MIT programming environment Scratch, right, Peter? You're thinking the when I receive broadcasts. And if it receives something that doesn't follow the spelling, it didn't receive That's it. That's right. I can't see it. Why am I worried about it?
I'm having a I'm having a lot of fun driving the Pratt Dynamo. Ah, here we go. Put on riding. Uh, 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 cap. Yeah. Usually, Peter, in interactive fiction, you can just type the noun. So, I notice oh. you're carefully typing everything, but you can, there you go. <coughs> Unless there's more than one cap in the game, in which case you might need to type the adjective. What's an index card? <coughs> What's an index card? My boy asks, what's an index card? Do you feel old? It's just a little piece of paper. Three by five card. Could be bigger than that. Three by five inch, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. What's an index card, he asks. Go ahead. What's the joke? No wonder you don't know what an index card is. I don't have any index cards. On my iPad, I'm showing my son a picture of what index cards oh, are. Oh, you... Those are index oh, cards. You, you sore you winner. See, you see what index cards yes, are? Yes, yes. Now you know what index cards are. We'll file that as a lesson under your homeschool plan for today. History of ancient media learned what an index card is. Didn't I just give? Yeah, so then I should have just paid off my debt, right? Why don't you type help people and see how to interact with people? If a first person shooter were um were a text adventure game, then even though it will have no graphics, so it might to some extent uh destroy the concept of the shooter, the commands and the gameplay would still be the same, you know, inventory, pistol, uh so what you're saying is you're seeing a connection between these games and the games that now, you play. Now programming is about the same. Like you could, you could still say you could still do throw Pharopod or Alex stand there in a text adventure game or something like that. This this came to mind when I looked at. You can also issue simple commands. Okay. Let's try ask. Allo. No. Uh, uh. It'll actually recognize Al. <laughs> I got tired of typing out and was just, well, beta testing the game, or alpha testing the game. Can I run Al over?
Uh oh. Oops, is this plot required? I was just so glad. <laughs> this doesn't take it to standard Well, American I'm pleased that I programmed Al Shut Up, <laughs> and I'm crushed that I didn't program Get Outta as a synonym for exit. I'll remember that for Get my next out game. of Dynamo. You betcha. No. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> Set brake, the parking brake is already yes. because it says Aloysius stops the dynamo from running rolling okay. away. Get out of dynamo. Enter. He says, I'm not sure how to understand that correctly. We should prop. And then He'd he says, say, examine McDuga. He doesn't know who McDuga is. Uh, I wonder if. Want something done right? You enter it yourself. How long does this game go on? How, why am I still in chapter one even after all these events? Are you bored with it? Damn it. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm, just, I'm sorry, that must have implied the wrong thing, but I can't tell how long a chapter is. That's a good point. I said. Take Mac. Oh, of course, if it doesn't recognize it once, maybe if you say it <laughs> twice, it will recognize it.
the O in of actually shouldn't be capitalized, neither should the T and V. However, I do appreciate that you backspaced and edited that lame of a joke. Okay. Okay, I... I uh, Scarf, goggles. Type look and see what's in the environment. Uh-oh. <laughs> He's gone down into the ditch while you were playing with the interface. He left. Was Joey your heart north or south? There is no jewel here. Uh, uh, you also melody have sweet. A typo here.
No, was the train still? Oh, well. He's disappeared into the woods. If you are trying to interact with something in the environment, notice train station is not mentioned in this environment, mm -hmm. so typing train station is probably not going to work. Is there a command for swerve? Daddy, is there a command for swerve? There is not. I do believe it says that she is walking along the side of the road, not in the middle of the road, however. Did you read the piece of paper that was fluttering around in the car? No. You know what? It saw put on and I thought you were trying to put it on like you would put on a hat. That's why it gives you that odd answer. And was my score 7 before I ran into the man? I think it was.
What am I doing wrong? If zooming past... Read the paper again. that in on purpose when I said when I typed oops I forgot the polite part. Um, this interpreter actually lets you correct typos by typing oops and then you type the correct word. So it just saw the word oops and thought you were trying to correct a typo. Ah. Is the dynamo Troy Sterling's or since it's the Pratt dynamo is it Aloysius Pratt's? In my mind Mr. Pratt designed it. Mm. But Troy probably paid for it. Try release. Does he have any title? Is he is he a lord or anything? How did he end up being so wealthy? I believe if at the very beginning of the game you try to examine your estate, there's some reference to um, he made his money by inheriting a perfume fortune, something mm. like that. Mm. It's very subtle, but yes, I, I had to answer that question for myself, um, even though it's not important to the game. Mm -hmm. Very good. Pretty weird. Why don't you just try typing stop? Well, you could. What do you want to wave at the bucket? Go ahead, wave at the bucket. I don't know what's going to happen. No, type wave at the bucket. I want to see what happens when you wave at the bucket. <laughs> All right. Oh, what? You programmed it too well. I, <laughs> that actually sounds like a default response, not something that I wrote myself. So, thank Graham Nelson for that. <laughs> What you typed. You didn't have to program in seatbelts, did you? No, I didn't.
for examining the hatchling. Good idea. We're going to X hatchling. Mm -hmm. Ah. Well, this sure is interesting, but how many uh, characters characters or sprites do I have to go through before I actually get to the train station? You know, a sprite actually um is something visual. Uh, um, that that is a term from um, MIT Scratch. There we go. There you go. Yeah. Right. You are encountering NPCs, non-player characters. Mm -hmm. Same term in Half Life Two. Same term in um, all the other games that you play. Arc. I. Sinemo, ladies, Sinemo, but be ye bright and bonny. Why? Never mind. Why wait? Good.
to look and see if the dynamo is in the environment here. <laughs> so Peter, would you like to share your feelings right now? Mm-hmm. I have been. Where were you? <laughs> sighing, falling asleep, being deathly bored. Who is sighing, falling asleep, and being deathly bored? Never mind. Are oh, you saying I'm? Oh, West. Uh, uh, mm -hmm. I'm not. Mm -hmm. Are you deathly bored? I'm Peter. If you don't want to keep playing, you don't have to. No, I'm, I'm just, I'm just a little okay. bit annoyed because it won't let me apologize for calling her Miss Sweat. <laughs> I believe the "oh, don't apologize" is is a default response to any time you type a word like "sorry" or "apologize." So, that that was not something that I coded myself. <laughs> I'll master this. Took longer to master the RTS gameplay into Dynamo. Maybe if I bring the Dynamo to her. Uh, I should really should start the engine before I turn off the brake. Is there a way to equip a, a hotkey or something? Um, Good, you want to save it? She should be following you at this point. Mm -hmm. Probably I'm what think, happened, I'm Peter, thinking. is... No, 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 I don't think you did anything wrong, Peter. Mm. Probably what happened is I assumed that everybody would show her the sign before you entered the train station, and you didn't do that. So, you didn't, this isn't a problem with yours, it's a problem with my game, which was less than perfect, shall we say. It's still going along pretty well here. Let's, let's, uh, uh, let's try this. I could undo a whole bundle of turns. I don't think you can undo that. <coughs> Bless you. You just... I don't think you can undo that many. Mm -hmm. Let me just try to, uh, let me see if there's something I can do. Um, yeah, sorry about this, guys. We'll probably edit this out of the uh, version we put on YouTube yeah. anyway, so let's see if I can Go rescue this. That out. You say so. You need to get closer if you still want to be in this. Okay. That's enough. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Where was I? Oh, yeah.
Okay, so let's see. There, there we go. All right. Would you be so kind as to take me to Professor Sneedle, and now I will follow you. All right. Got it. Good job. Uh, uh, we paused the show. I went back, went through some commands and so forth, and the problem was I hadn't shown Miss Sweet the sign before we started talking to her. She wouldn't follow me. So, and now she, wouldn't follow now she me, follows yeah. us. Yeah. Okay. All right. So Good job. That was some really work on your part. Well, uh, if 10 years ago I programmed this better... Yeah. I wouldn't have had to do this brilliant work, but you're a positive thinker, so I appreciate that. Okay, now I should put trunk in dynamo. Now, oh, how likely is it that this will work, but it's fun. That's sort of a reaction again. Excuse me. Okay. <coughs> I'm going to go need to get a tissue. Oh. Box. Okay, we're going to pause this part. Uh-huh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Your score has just gone down by one point. Okay, okay we're back after a little break. Keep going, Peter. <laughs> take Miss Sweet. It never occurred to me. Let me see if I can put her in my I'm inventory. Take hand. You think that a kid in the, in the early twentieth century would have quit? You typed. You think that I would have learned this in advance if I'm a gentleman? How old is uh? How old do you imagine that uh? The um. Hold on. Wave two. Oh dear. Character. Oh, Troy Sterling. How old do you imagine Troy Sterling? I don't know, is? late twenties. <clears throat> Makes a somewhat different gesture. Oh dear. What did I do wrong now? Who won the race between you and the train? You want to restore? I'm thinking. Oh, so I'm supposed to be a show off. I thought that, that smashing into the train would make me lose points.
there's something you need to do. There we go. Reporter. do when a car is in front of you going too slow. Maybe I should try something like accelerate north. If there's a car in front of you going too slow, accelerating won't help you get past the car. Hold on, I'm sorry, I was getting over enthusiastic here. What's with the Muppet voice? I just don't know. The Jar Jar voice. Hold on, <laughs> Hold on index card. Works its way out of the train. It's even with a freight car. It's even with a passenger coast. Slow moving Surrey. I should have swerved around Surrey or something. Okay, I'll restore one more time. This one. Mm -hmm. Come on, Daddy, we're in the middle of the recording. I posted a tweet saying how much fun I'm having with my son playing fine tune. Do you mind? Is it acceptable to you? I better not screw her this time. He yells at me for being on the internet too much. Not true. You just made your run to Valby not to use this in front of the family, right? When you had nothing I, else. I, that was during Lent. It's not Lent anymore. Oh, 
How do I get around a slow moving Surrey? You don't get around it. It's something, it's, it's something you've already done in the Pratt Dynamo twice to solve problems. But to advance oh. the plot anyway. There you go. Uh oh. There we go. Ah! This would have solved so many problems if I had read the chart. If only you'd read the instructions that I provided for you, available to you on the very first turn of the game. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. Should I honk horn or stop? You could save. <laughs> Uh-oh. What did I say? You're not doing too well there, boy, are you? Yeah. Uh. Ah, I kind of like that myself. Look for water source. 
<laughs> Think of something. Get a horse. Maybe I should have waved at the driver instead. Did I save after I made a race? You're doing fine. Well, that sure helped. Wave at her, then she laughs at him, too. Get a horse! Pump. Pump. There. Can't explain that one, Peter. There we go. I knew that he had done it. I defeated him. That's what I call a boss battle in a, in a text adventure game.
Nah. Uh, they picked good names for the chapters. Thank you. Do you want a break? You want to keep playing? Mm, maybe for a little while longer. Then okay. we can do something else like DDL. It's okay. been a while since we've done that, hasn't okay. it been? Agreed. So I thought you would enjoy it. I really thought he'd poison himself. Thank you. I'm glad it worked. I did see that coming. <laughs> Thank you. I... When the screen is frozen like that, you have to type one key to unfreeze it, and you've been, and then, then that's why you have ache manuscript there, because the T that you typed to unfreeze the screen wasn't recognized, so that's just a feature of the interface.
Stone Soup Melody. Try just try play manuscript. I think that'll work. The quotation marks are going to screw up. It is 5.30. I might be back any minute. You looking for a break? I don't know. Let's try. Okay. I'll try to talk to him a little bit more, but I don't really want to launch into another adventure. Okay. Fury is going to mess things up. I just type prof. Talk to prof. That should work. True East or Magnetic East? The game doesn't care. Ah, I see I have tran I see that I've changed characters. Ready for a break? Okay. All right. What do you think so far? I think it's a pretty good game. How many chapters did you program into it? Four. Four. Yes, I think that's right. Four. Yes. Is the chapter is the chapter organization system fairly common? In some games, um, I think it was. I just program this them as chapters in order to make it very clear when you see a chapter break that a big change is happening. Mm -hmm. No, what, it's not so bad, is it? No. What do you think is going to happen next? I don't know. I'll go on a big journey and the professor will crack more jokes about the old, your mentor gets poisoned and you have to save him technique. Darn, that's why we need Carolyn. We better, we better change quickly if we're going to play anything. Okay. I had fun. Good. <laughs>